Hey everyone, welcome to a useless JC Poly ITE tier list that doesn't have any value. I'm your host, Mr. One again, and welcome to today's tier list. Starting off, we have Raffles Institution. They have the most prestige, but also very high suicide rates. They also have a very competitive environment, and for that reason, I'm just going to put them in the E tier. More expensive. Seriously, $300 to take Singapore in level. What kind of joke is that? Moving on, we have East Coast JC, located right next door to whatever these two things are, and who for some reason is always on the news to get over cases. And for that reason, I'm gonna put them in the E tier for East Coast. Actually, you know what? While we're at it, let's just add the rest of the East Coast thing into the E tier. So here goes Badok South JC, and here goes Kalang West Government Chinese Middle School, or DHS. Moving on, I'm just going to put all the merged JCs into the F tier, to pay respects of course, to all the culture that went into the shadow realm as a result of the merger. Very sad momento. Moving on to something more positive, let's talk about Long Chuan JC. Now, it seems like a really good school, good A-level results, you can wear t-shirt all 5 days of the week, and for that, I'm going to put them in the S tier for STEM school, EJC, ah yes. Now, they have an attractive view and a gorgeous scenery. Like, imagine studying with this scenery. And for that reason, I'm going to put them in the A tier for attractive architecture. Hua Chong Institution, Buna Vista JC, and ACSI. Now, I'm just going to put these two schools together into the S tier for sports. SGI, ah yes. The other IBJC. That's a formula of Sally and myself. I would love to put it in the SS tier. But for fair comparison's sake, I'm just gonna put them in the A tier. For ACSI rejects. Millennial Institute. Okay, so I was gonna make a joke where I replace one world with something else, but then I'm gonna get cancelled. So I'm just gonna put them into the C tier for being the only school that offers the commerce stream. Actually, while we're at it, let's just add the Lee Sing Long JC here as well. River Valley High School which is located in, you guessed it, Jurong West. And you know what, these guys, they've been through a hard time. And so, let's just give them a break and let them move into the A tier. Kalang River JC. I mean, nothing special, really just an average JC. No interesting subject combinations at all. Just put them into the D tier. They don't even offer app math or computing. Moving on to the polytechnics, let's start with Dover Poly. I think it's only right to put them in the S tier for Subway and Starbucks, and the other two outlets they have. Now seeing that NP is practically in the same spot as SP, I'm just going to put them in the S tier as well. There you go, SP's next door neighbor. Nanyang Poly, A for Ang Mokyo. Termasek Poly. One time is funny, two times is skin annoying. You know, you think of anything. I mean, they have a law course. E. Next, Republic Poly. Oh yes, I fondly remember of this Poly. Because my teacher googled polyrejects.com, the Republic Poly website showed up. And for that reason, I'm going to put them in the C tier for comedy, ITE. I think I'm just going to bunch all these chaps into the D tier. Or please let them wear their own t-shirts. No one wants to wear their ugly uniform. Okay, so we should have everything here now. This guy missing something though. Ah yes, of course, Chatter JC. They belong in one tier and one tier only. The SS tier. For staircase 6. So well, hopefully you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe, and hopefully I'll see you in the next video. Assuming MOE doesn't knock on my door.